Hi, I'm Shelley Wood, and this is my tiny sewing room where I make doll clothes sewing videos. Today, I'm going to show you how to make a super simple skirt like this snowman skirt for the winter holidays, this gingham skirt for springtime, or this candy corn skirt for fall. Before we begin, please go to ShellyWood.com to download this free printable sewing pattern. Use your pattern to cut out the skirt's fabric. Create a double fold hem by folding once and then a second time. Just like you see me doing here, you fold once and then you fold a second time. Stitch the hem from one end to the other. You can use a sewing machine or you can do a whip stitch. Your pattern is marked with the lines that will guide you. If you need help with the whip stitch, I actually have a tutorial for that in the links below this video on YouTube. Create a casing next by folding once and then a, fold it a second time, but this time it's a deeper fold. Again, follow the pattern's measurement guide but if you still need more help with your casing, see my casing tutorial in the description below this video on YouTube. The key is to make sure that the raw edges match up when you bring them together. So you fold your casing once and then a second time and it's a deeper fold. Pin along the folded edge of the casing. Adjust pins as needed before stitching the casing. So what I'm doing is checking to see if the raw edge is exactly the same and if not, you need to adjust that pin to make sure that these are going to match up. These raw edges, the cut edges. Stitch the casing's folded edge and now your casing should look like this. Measure your doll's waist for elastic. Cut your elastic to fit very snug. Place a safety pin through the end of the elastic and send the elastic through the casing. Hold the elastic ends in place with straight pins. Make sure the pins penetrate all the way through the elastic on both sides of the casing, like this. So I send my elastic through. This is about a half inch elastic, braided elastic. I've got my safety pin that I'm pushing through the casing. When it starts to get close to the end, I insert a straight pin about an inch from the edge. Then I keep pushing that safety pin all the way through to the other end. And with that straight pin on the far side, it'll hold it in place. I put another straight pin on this side and then I remove my safety pin. Give it a couple tugs and now your skirt should look like this. Fold it in half as shown here, but don't remove the straight pins just yet. So here I am folding mine in half. You want to keep those straight pins in so the elastic doesn't come apart. And then sew from the elastic at the waist down the length of the skirt to the hem. Now your skirt should look like this. Trim away any extra elastic at the waist. Remove the straight pins and invert the skirt. So that's what I'm doing here. Just flip it right side out. You can remove 
remove your straight pins before you flip it if you want to. Now you're ready to try it on your doll. For more free printable sewing patterns for dolls of many shapes and all different sizes, please remember to visit my website, ShellyWood.com. What if there was an easy way to take a big doll pattern and resize it to fit a little doll, or vice versa? I'm Shelly Wood, the doll clothing designer, and in my pattern alteration class, I'm going to share with you my resizing formula. Pattern alteration is when you take a pattern that you already own and you make changes to it. Let's say a dress doesn't fit your doll quite right. I'll show you how to create a gusset to extend the dress's bodice. Along the same lines, I'll show you how to use a doll's body measurements to lengthen and shorten shirt sleeves and to recreate the pants patterns you already own so they will fit dolls of different shapes and sizes. Following my instructions, you'll learn how to reshape dresses and skirts, making them fuller or less full depending on the look you're going for. With this collection of more than 40 videos, you'll use my measurement guide and dozens of tips and tricks to create a full wardrobe for the dollar dolls of your choice. I invite you to join me. We are going to have so much fun.